come back to the channel. Today is the first day of uh, my long trip to Iceland. So it's 4.30 in the morning and I'm on the way to the Larvik city to take a ferry. to take ferry from Larvik city it's about uh, two hours away from here and this year this is the long trip to the Iceland the land of fire and ice so guys follow me and enjoy the whole trip Here is the Drummond city. That is the Drummond city. See? We have a lot of tunnels in uh, Norway. A lot. Everywhere. It's uh, long. I didn't see the boat. How long is it? But it should be maybe 3-4 kilometers or more. Uh, maybe two, two and a half kilometers or three. That's all. Larvik, 70 kilometers. Tunnel is a little bit, uh, one degree is warmer than outside. I noticed on the temperature on the screen. So we have to go out in the exit there and uh, to the Tunsberg. Fix the GPS and uh, now back on the road. In three kilometer, we have to exit this road and uh, totally, I think the ship terminal is about nine kilometer or ten. Now we have to find out Larik on the right. Hello, CMX forty three thirty three. Shin Shdaudin Shinwari. Thanks, God. Do Okay. 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 Business class. And go in. I was very tired when I come in to the ship. Uh, so this is the situation here. People are waiting in restaurants and different floors. And uh, maybe after a hour we will be arrived to the Denmark a few moments later welcome back uh, we are arrived at, to the Herschel city so welcome to Denmark This is the Hetral city. 
I'm here first time. I don't know how it's look like. We will see. Hello, hello. Nobody in reception? I'm uh, in the hotel. So the room is small, but uh, it's very good. Hello everyone, good morning, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today is the second day and uh, it's 6.30 in the morning and we have the trip to uh, Iceland. The boat will be today and tomorrow and the next day uh, about uh, 10 o'clock uh, will be arrived at uh, the pier in uh, Iceland. So join me and uh, let's do it together. What is Kalfilu one? I bought it to my den, so. Yeah. Okay. These two guys are from Italy. Uh, they have been in North Cop also, I think. So you see them. So it's uh, very early. putting my logo on his uh, hair for you logo down 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 yes a few moments later The ship or map on the screen. Uh, we are here, and here is the Norway Bergen. And now we are close to Faroe Island, so it will take the whole day and then to Iceland. Here is the top deck. Welcome to Faroe Island.
hello everyone good morning welcome back to the channel uh, we are still in the ship and uh, we're close to Iceland maybe take about one and a half hours so stay with us and enjoy the video guys we are rich and now we are going down to take the cycles from the deck and let's hit the road in Iceland so welcome to Iceland so we are getting ready to get out in a few minutes so stay with us and enjoy the video so custom guys this was Norona Torshavan Smiril line. The first waterfall you see there, fantastic. So guys, the weather is 13 plus degree and uh, we will see how things working here. The first waterfall, it's uh, very from upside is coming, you know. guys welcome back it's too late finally we find a place here in the middle of nowhere so we just check in so let me show you the place how it looks like the dining hall it's a kitchen it's like a big house and bath house it's a sauna so guys, uh, today's video is ending here and uh, see you on the next video. So take care and goodbye. The alien was found in the movie Prometheus. There. He was fall down I think so on the way. And if you see, he helped him.
Good morning everyone. It's very early in the morning, 5 o'clock, day 5, and we are in uh, the hotel. And uh, you see how it looks like outside. So the other guys still sleeping, so I can make coffee. Hello and welcome back. Uh, we are uh, finished inside and now we are on the way to four different locations. Uh, so stay with me and enjoy the video. This is the pump. So we have to refill and then hit the road. We are now ready to hit the road. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. As we came to the first destination, the name of this uh, waterfall is Ditti Fos, 800 meters. The alien was found in the movie Prometheus. There. Here are some information about this uh, waterfall. This one. I have to go down. Guys, back to the parking lot. This was very good hiking. Drone is not allowed and let the force. He was fall down, I think, so on the way. And if you see, he helped him. Here we supposed to the left. Ah, here is this uh, geyser. This is the name of the place. Namakya. Smell like uh, gas. Incredible. Guys, welcome back. Uh, we are already finished with this second location and now we are moving to the third location. So join us in this beautiful trip in the land of fire and ice. There is also coming smell from this gas. This water is totally blue, sky blue. Look at this 4x4 Toyota Jeep. Back on the road for uh, 
we take contact with the third guy he is there somewhere it's getting cold we have to ride uh, all over to the north uh, one place is their location it's called arctic something like that i don't know Very windy here. Almost we are very up in the north side. There is fjord maybe on the right side there. Small waterfall there. We have to go down. You see, Mr. Wild. You see, it's a look like kind of animal. Hello, everyone. Good morning. Welcome back to the channel. We are on the top of uh, the Iceland, the north side. Yesterday we came here and we are still in the hotel. Now we are ready to hit the road. This was the hotel. And we all three are ready to hit the road toward Reykjavik. So this is the town where we came yesterday. There was a monument on the top for that. mountain the beach Look at that mountain, it looks like a volcano, <laughs> but it's not volcano, it's just a cloud on the top, it looks like smoke and 
look at this one. Incredible. Some mountain over there, they have snow on the top. The bridge. Here is the first tunnel. Yes, finally. You like the cruise ship? So you just make a short stop here. What do you want? Yeah, if you want, come on, no problem. The guys want to drink tea here. It's a beautiful area. 2.2 kilometers straight and then maybe somewhere left or right. Left, I think. See? Fairy tale building. Enjoy the off-road Back to the civilization <laughs> Guys we come to this point These other two guys are already here from down You see it's a look like kind of animal Finish with this point and now Back on the road So let's enjoy the music and video. Fun. This is real adventure. In the middle of nowhere, yes, uh, tower, something. We are came out to the civilization. Very heavy wind. You see, the cycle is like this. Not straight. Very, very heavy. Oh my goodness. Put in the fourth gear. Powerful. Look at that beautiful mountain. High. 109 kilometers still to Reykjavik. So we have to eat a little bit then back on the road. Welcome back. We want to eat a little bit and then we hit the road. So, in a few hours we will be arrived to the hotel. We came on the other side of the this uh, lake or fjord or sea. I think we are 
entering Reykjavik. This is the streets of Reykjavik. They put it in, huh? The rock is so sharp, I just take it from there. And look what they did to me. Good morning everyone and welcome back to the channel. Inshallah tomorrow we will be leaving here on the south side. So stay with us and enjoy the video. Guys welcome back. We are ready to hit some places to go there let's go navy coast guard ship see This is the church. Let's see, guys. Few moments later, again, come out to the off road. Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> Nothing happened to you, right? Everything is okay. Very beautiful area. Look at that. Look at that. Wow. See the road.
look at this view from here. So many people. A drone, I think so. It's not allowed. It's take time. I don't know how long. So back on the road guys and now to the next destination. Guys welcome back. We are finished with the Gulfos, this uh, waterfall and now we are going to the, this active volcano down, down on Reykjavik south. What's your name? My name is uh, Zia. Zia, German Leo. Thank you, thank you. Nice talking to you. Yeah, I'm gonna thank go you. in the bus because we're yeah, okay, okay. Far, you know? Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, Joe. Yeah, thank, thank you. He's guide. He's French. They subscribe to the channel, and uh, he's working here three years. He told me that. So he said, "I like Norway." I say, "Come visit Norway." Guys, uh, we are going to the volcano eruption site, so this is the way, and it's also off road. <laughs> There's the one we went is 800 meter up, and see, this is the lava. See that lava. I think I... This is the lava. Now, we go to the up viewpoint. I'm very tired. Oh my The old day bike. Different places. And from there, if you see the road from there, we walk here. The rock is so sharp, I just take it from there and look what they did to me. That crystal sharp. This is my first volcano to see from close to range. I never have been at the volcano site. I see their helicopter maneuvering. Still, the smoke is coming out, but you can't uh, see it. Maybe you guys can see it. You see the helicopter, the 
black. Hello everyone, good morning, welcome back to the channel. Yesterday we have been uh, at the volcano and it was about 6 km walking and uh, totally it was 12 km we just uh, up and down. So very, I was very tired and on the back from there we didn't make a uh, video because it was raining and it was very really windy and all batteries were down so today we are heading towards south uh, and uh, I don't know yet uh, how they put the map uh, on the GPS and where, where we going so it's uh, windy for Iceland it's best weather so let's uh, enjoy together so we are ready now Sixteen plus degree. For now, it's feeling a little bit better, but uh, after I don't know. Getting colder a little bit. Lot of tourists here. Everyone go to there and take selfie, uh, like a, a memorable frame for <laughs> for the waterfall. Welcome back guys uh, i'm getting ready and it's very cold goodbye waterfall so now i have to go there find out and go maybe up oh my goodness this is a lot of After a terrible uh, rain on the way, so uh, I'm waiting for other guys. They are went to the ice cave 
somewhere and I've just come in in the restaurant and also order this uh, beautiful lamb soup nice Asad Pashtun, this is for you. That one. Look, Leo, fault again. channel so today we don't know what we do but uh, we are doing further and two nights more and then we get the to the ship so stay with us and enjoy the video welcome back to the channel and i want to go one place find out uh, one of the guys from my area he was mentioned that uh, there is a beach which is uh, totally black so now i am going to search of this so asad pashtun this is for you and uh, i will come back here and then we hit the road toward south so stay with us and enjoy the video Maybe raining that area. So I am reached. Now I have to walk. Look to these. Uh Rock formation. That one. I was lucky nobody was there. Bismillah. I hope everything will be fine. ADV has already come out. This ADV, yeah? Huh? It's adventure. No, this is not. Ah, jeez. Uh, the regular. Ah, yeah, okay. Uh, Trophy. We have the adventures in, in December. <laughs> uh, November, December. Where are you heading today? We, we are on the way south to the ferry. Yeah, sure. Right there, okay. Sure, sure. That's, that's good. That's good. Take care. Thank you very much. Take care and, uh, <laughs> yeah, go. <laughs> we go to Kielabaki today. Oh, yeah. Look at oh. okay. uh, This approach, is the mountain yeah. road. Yeah, mountain. <laughs> <laughs> they are the um, BMW Motorrad Iceland. They have trip and all, if you see, all of them is 1300. Uh, the new bike of the same uh, company. And uh, but they look small, but uh, they are 13.
get the road. Look, Leo fault again. The ground is not level there, it's a, it's a that. Guys, we are now close to the Diamond Beach. So guys, here is this uh, Diamond Beach. Uh, I think so, they call it because as uh, this uh, ice blocks. You don't want oil? Full. Check in is at 4 and check out is at 11, like you know. Okay. Hello everyone, good morning, welcome back to the channel. So we have to fill up tanks. And then we hit the road to our next destination.
Guys, look at that view. A few moments later. Welcome back, guys. I skipped that uh, location with them, and uh, I have to go direct to the hotel. It will take me about three hours, three two minutes, and it is 208 kilometers from here. So hope step by step and uh, take a little bit rest in the hotel because we, I am totally exhausted this one week. I need some rest. So guys, enjoy the music and video. It's raining here, no chance for room. Look at that. Amazing. Look at that peak. But all the bridges is small. You have to wait for another one. This is old version. Maybe they can make new. Now we coming to the other side. Guys see this incredible view and this road. It's very good but not much traffic, totally empty road. And here I think I can make a break. A few moments later. Oh, this one. <laughs> Look at this road here.
fault here on the gravel so look So guys, this was another part of adventure. <laughs> this guy helped me. That time was because a lot of fog. So even barely see this, the ground. But these mistakes teach you. Bismillah rahman rahim So now I have to slowly go down. I'm thinking about tomorrow how we can, I can make it. Yeah, if it's possible. A few moments later. back to the channel just a few hours in uh, Iceland and then we go to the feria inshallah so let's do it that point it's asphalt and rest and gravel what are you doing see start gravel i hope there is no fog outside yeah yeah yeah, yeah. sorry I really don't understand these birds. They are just uh, showing the way, <laughs> chasing all the way in second gear. Shabash Liu, well done Liu. Come on, and there is a waterfall also. Then one trip to Iceland, it's supposed to be three times to see it, same place. But no people, no car because mostly people are sleeping. Chilly wind and wet. 
it's very difficult when you you put yourself in this kind of situation when you are tired and it's uh, it was tough for me because no visibility the wind the fog the tiredness everything was included and i was felt here That was the place yesterday. You see a lot of stones easily. You can fall down. I hope there is no fog. very cold wind some places a little bit acceptable part and up is totally disaster i don't know how early i came out i didn't see the the, the clock but it could be 5 cuz something But if I make it to the puffin bird, I can do it. But I don't know if I have time there, you know. It will be a big win for me across this. Sorry guys I don't put the other camera in front because in this situation is not possible to control it So for now this one maybe some view is blocked but nothing special to see here Now it start fog I think so this area is more fog and to know circles It's more cold. Oh. You see fog. The problem is if you go down, so nobody can help you here. Nobody is here. That's the problem. You are on your own. I don't know I came on this road yesterday the same road I don't understand why they're not doing a salt this may be expensive for them too much money my visor is too I can't see anything so I open it several time and but cold wind on the face and eyes not good When it's too cold, then I closing back. I was worried about because the ship. If I miss the ship, so I have to wait one week for another one. Only one time, yeah, in a, a week. One is from here, and one is from Denmark. So that was the reason I was worried a little bit. I'm in alone. doing with the nature yeah. not sure <laughs> but it's supposed to be here eh? there's only one road not no more to see you now i'm inshallah on the right track go up it's look like down but it's uh, up to the north
there is no rain there is a little bit uh, but there was big big drops you hear it you feel it but it's hard here is feel like no rain but it is that snow i have to stop somewhere at benzene station and uh, eat or drink something you know or wait wait for the other otherwise they say oh no it's in that so for now i am enjoying my own company talk to myself talk to the nature nobody is here and uh, in the group it's a stress i think it could be my last group riding because uh, you have no freedom you know and when you are riding alone it's better you decide where you to stop where to eat this and that no worries but with them i just ride you know like in hell just go there 2 3 minutes 5 minutes 10 minutes go there go there you know they, they are right in their own but for me it's just totally wrong because they have very little time and come from very far away so they have to see the things you know maximum in the very short time but i'm here i can come come any time but my next trip if it's possible to here it's could be in the plane and then i can take a when uh, uh, this uh, caravan with the house you know you can leave there rent that for some time and look around it will be good guys i was uh, very early at the boat so to decide to go and uh, watch the muffin boards so now i came but here is also tough uh, mountains and also fog and cold I reach to the Bofen area. So I hope I can find a way to find it. Here are some information about Bofen support piece. I don't know. People came for them from long distance. Yes, that's all. I have to move. All the rocks is fully, fully. Now see, they make holes, and they are here. So that's what. That's what that is. Good to see you. Oh, yeah, okay. Very nice. So, in that case, you need to take your bike. What are people, huh?
Finally, we are here. So we just uh, stopped by pump station and uh, because this other guy have very small bike so it's take only 10 liter. Welcome to Gutiborg. Good morning everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today is the last day and we are close to Hitchal city in Denmark. The ship will be sailing from Denmark to Sweden in Gutiborg. So I'm arriving inshallah 8 o'clock in uh, evening Gutiborg and then I have to ride toward Oslo. This will take me uh, three and a half hours there maybe, right? So totally it will take eight hours, nine hours. So stay with us, it will be interesting. And uh, today is the last day of this trip. So cross the finger and enjoy the video. So welcome to Denmark. We just uh, stopped by a pump station and uh, because this other guy have very small bike so it's take only 10 liters so often we have to stop for him to fill up you know. So we are on the way to Frederikshavn and it will take 23 minutes something old houses a few moments later guys welcome back uh, we are entered to the port you see the mr uh, mr paul the old man on the back well then he's uh, 84 years old and still is riding bike with this small bike yeah he have been in Iceland for one week come on guys what's going on now we get the confirmation to go inside so now I have to put it tight and then go upside okay now we come to the second floor. And we have lounge and they have this on the board. Next. This is the restaurant area. I'm going back to the seating area. I seated so far type. So I want to take rest and see you a little bit later. Guys, we are entering Gutiborg. You see, it's almost uh, 7:30 in the evening, and we will be arriving up. Five minutes from here to there to the stop, still 45 minutes. This is the bridge of Gutibo. We are getting ready to get out and hit the road toward Oslo. I hope make it safe because I'm very very tired. This So welcome to Gutiborg. 
So this is Gutiborg, the city of Sweden. Babe, this thing ain't working out. I think we need a new direction. Find myself on the open road. Well, what have I got to lose? Let the mountains, hills, and valleys grab my heart and take the Nobody's gonna make me stay You take the house, I'll take the car I'm leaving town and I'm going far away from here I don't care what no one's got to say You go your way You go your way You go your way I'll take the highway This is the customs house for Sweden and this after this bridge is Norway. Half bridge is Swedish, half is Norwe Norwegian. Very windy here. You see Norge. Hey, welcome to Norway. Now we are officially in Norway, you see? Ust called Filke, Harden Kommune. Norwegian uh, custom and house and checking is ahead. You see green zone and two customs green channel and red channel so it's like a free you can go but if you have something you have to turn on the right and there is a custom house you see this one you have to go on the right and there oh, oh, there you know there is a custom house finish so we are at home Leo welcome back home I'm very tired and uh, I'm just uh, you know pressure press myself to the maximum to be home early you know this is Norway Alden Kamuno Oslo it 
21 kilometer ahead. Welcome back. Uh, I make a break on the station to go to Thailand because I drank too much motor water today and uh, now we are very very close to, to home. The old man is left behind and he's not too much speeding but yeah. <laughs> And you tell me that you're doing fine Rolling color lights off Pulls you right on through the door It's a very long tunnel So hold on to all that feeds your soul I know a place the sun shines every day So come with me And I'll take you there I'll take you there Now we are entering uh, Oslo So almost entered so Now I have to outside. take the exit on my area that blocks you see and a little bit further on the top the weather is very good plus 16 degree and it's uh, very very pleasant to the right and finally I am on my street so guys uh, I wanna end the video here and see you on the next video goodbye talk is cheap and we're wasting time